Hi, it's Mike from Pro Tools Experts again, and today I'm going to take a look at this new spatial sound card from the guys at New Audio Technology. So what exactly is a spatial sound card? Well, firstly, it's not hardware, it's software. And basically what it's going to enable you to do is imagine the scenario you've been working on some surround audio content, maybe a DVD, and you've got an approval copy that you want to take to a client. So you take your laptop along to the office and you play it to the client. You say, well, you just have to trust me that the surround sound works and it's really great in surround. But it kind of leaves a bit of a bad taste in the mouth, really. Well, what the spatial sound card can do is it's basically the guys at New Audio Technology have taken the concept of binaural sound, where if you wear a pair of earphones or headphones, you can, if it's recorded appropriately, get the sense of full envelopment 360 degree sound. And so what they've done here is to use that sort of concept. And so you give the client a pair of headphones or a pair of earphones, and then you play them the surround content and they get the sense of the surround even though you're just playing it through a two-channel system because they're using this whole concept of binaural audio because after all we only got two ears and that's how we pick up surround sound so let's take a, a look at this so i'm going to start playing some audio which is a 5.1 recording So what you're listening to at the moment is the straight through signal. See here, a single pass through. And if I just click on this button, we go into surround. And what's happening here is that the sound is being effectively played through these virtual speakers. And so best to listen to this particular video on a pair of headphones or a pair of earphones. So we can actually change the environment that we're listening to. So at the moment it's as though we were sat in front of this particular mixer in this particular studio. So we have a range of studios here. So we could go down to uh, this one here. And once it's loaded, it's a different virtualization of a different space. And they have a whole range of spaces you can choose from. And even you can go into the same space. So if we go to Luna Studio One, This one's, as we can see here in the menu, a meter away. And we can go to the same point and be a little bit further away. So, so you can hear that the virtualization is a little bit different. So you can get a sense of what it would sound like in a particular room. And I must say, the first time I did this, when I pressed the solo button in the right speaker, I actually turned to look to it because uh, it really felt as though, uh, although I'm obviously wearing headphones at the moment, it really felt as if the sound was coming from over my right hand shoulder. It really was absolutely amazing. So if we just uh, unsolo that, so front right, in the center, go back to the surround on the left. So you've got different virtualizations. So if you want one that's a little more neutral, then uh, I find this one is really quite useful. It's much drier, it's a much tighter sound because it's a mobile recording studio. And not only do we have the option to try different locations, we can do different configurations from stereo all the way up uh, to different 7.1 configurations and we can also edit the spaces so we can change the way the decays work because obviously it's a room virtualization 
and we even can tweak the EQ for different sets of headphones. So at the moment I'm listening, actually I've got a pair of Sony 7509s, but this is a fairly close approximation. It really helps me to hear what it sounds like, so they're compensating for the EQ on the headphones. And I must admit that iPhone earbuds has got a very interesting curve to it. So at the moment I'll go back to flat because obviously I don't know what your headphones are but you can see there that you can compensate for different types of headphones. So there we go, that's a, a quick look around at this uh, spatial sound card uh, from the guys at New Audio Technology. But yeah, it's just a really useful and neat idea to be able to take a laptop and to be able to play some uh, DVD or game sound, you know, give the client uh, the chance to really get a sense and experience what the surround sound sounds like without having to cart a whole load of surround speakers around or take the client into a surround studio. So great, really neat trick from the, the guys at New Audio Technology and look forward to a review in due course when they've got a new version out of their spatial audio designer software which is a plugin that we can use in Pro Tools that takes this technology on several steps and helps us to better produce very interesting sounds and also up mixing of sounds from stereo up to 5.1 to 7.1 even to 22.2. So look forward to that in the coming months and I'll see you soon.